welcome to the vlog day september 2nd and your girl is feeling good she's feeling quite marvelous today you know compared to last week Thank you so much for those who uh, commented with their sincere, warm thoughts and tips and just checking on your girl to make sure everything was going good and getting ready to go walk around this park here and get some steps in and then start like my fitness journey and just really pouring back into myself, getting back to me. I think that is so important right now. I am thinking about changing my injection a uh, day because I did not take my injection last week, I skipped last week, I'm thinking about taking it today. So I haven't taken it yet. This will be the 7.5. I have made a decision that I am going to skip every other week and take the injection, but um, I don't know. I feel good, like I said, and for me to have dropped two pounds and I haven't even taken an injection, I think that is still good so of course it's still in my system i've noticed that my appetite has increased a little bit more and i think that's a good thing I don't have the urge to like take injections every week i don't feel it i really don't so that is the reason why i'm just going to just do every other week but yeah let's go ahead and start walking and then we're gonna go into some stores real quick and just enjoy this weekly vlog with me. The skin is skinny. I don't have no makeup on at all. Girl, this is cute. All right, let's go. While I was out here. All right, girl, I've been out here since we're at 25 minutes, 1.19 miles. I'm tired. I'm gonna do one more round. This park is quite huge, okay? And slow is steady. You don't need to like speed walk unless that's something that you can handle. But yeah. <laughs> spaghetti all the way up to the top here and all of that just get a little bit get some bread bam and there you go Okay, so in this clip, I am getting ready to change my stats. I need to lower it down. So I'm doing 500 to 250, 45 to 20 minutes. My stand up is going to be from 12 to 8. This way I can improve myself. All right, so here I'm getting ready to make a little small egg and cheese quesadilla. I got my butter, my egg, cheese, just a little pinch. I don't even have to measure anymore because I know exactly um, how much
page 157 um, beats per hour. <laughs> that was a struggle. I'm not even gonna lie. That was like a huge struggle right there. Where is my lip gloss? Because bells. Okay. These bad boys right here. Keep doing the same thing over and over. Eventually, these five pounds is going to feel like eight pounds. Now, two months ago, this was no issue. My eight pound dumbbells, no issue. Holding this, I feel a lot of stress. <laughs> so I can't even imagine me doing a workout now, two months later, and this is like really like heavy, heavy duty. So what I am going to do is progressive overload um as i stated in another video yeah i'm going to be drinking my bcas and i have my creatine in here now i did forget to take my measurements i need to take my measurements again because i do have some news that i need to share with you i'm not going to share it right now but i will share it tomorrow when i do the uh the measurements because i need to do that yeah and I don't want to talk too much because, like I said, my lips is chapped and I cannot find my lip gloss. I'm tired of being treated like this. <laughs> Isn't it lovely? It's hump day. <laughs> All right, so I'm outside walking, of course, on my... 30 minute why do I look so shiny on my uh on my 30 minute lunch break I was uh just watching Patrice Denise yeah girl them puff bars you're gonna enjoy it make sure that you nuke the uh the actual bar the thick bar not the puff bar but nuke it in the microwave for about just a few seconds so it can get like a little warm but not melt like the the brownie batter when you do that put it on a plate get you a fork and it literally feels like you're eating a warm brownie after my workout last night that you just saw i took the glutamine this morning i came to work i was like what in the world is going on my stomach would not turn me loose until I turn it loose. We are going to do the measure, okay? There is a reason why I'm doing this, but we are going to measure. So the bust is 35, 35. The belly button. I am at a 28. Okay. But my skin is right there. And I've always had this after my third child. A 33 at my fupa. Right there. Twenty-one and a half. So, twenty-one and a half. Right. Well, I'm still a twelve. Well, yeah. So, my right arm is a twelve. To what my doctor has planned for me while being in maintenance mode. So going forward, it is straight maintenance on seven point five. I will be taking my injections every other week. I already took it for this week because I skipped last week. I actually took it on Monday. I wanted to change my injection day because um, the fact that two days leading up to your next injection, you do have like a, um, your, dang it, your appetite tends to increase. So instead of it increasing during the midweek when usually I go out to eat on the weekends, usually there's celebrations on the weekends. I do want to be able to enjoy myself and eat a little bit more. So, which is why I changed it to Monday. So Saturday and Sunday, I'll have a chance to eat a little bit more uh, higher in calories. Now, 
the reason why I'm doing maintenance is because my doctor wants to wing me off of the injections period. So basically what he wants me to do is stay on my grind and act like I know what the deal is so we don't have to repeat this again, okay? So that's basically where I'm at right now and my my authorization is going to end sometime in November. I did check uh, my TDEE and putting in all of my information, your girl has went from obese to overweight to now normal. Okay, so let's go ahead and work out, shall we? And then I'll tell you what my weight is. chicken fajita bowl you know like chipotle so i added accents i added garlic powder i added this right here we don't have no more sazoon then here i added i got my little fajita going on right here it was burning but then my husband saved the day so it's on low and I got my brown rice cooking over there and he got his uh, chicken pasta I don't know it's Latali I got it from I think Burlington or Ross Ross paid $5.99 so I got to get some more
So here I have my meal prep for tomorrow, which will be Thursday. And then at the cilantro, here's some little breakfast things I got for two for seven. And here's the final product. Thanks for watching.